Men's basketball taking on Atlantic 10 Power UMass. The Saints are looking for their first victory over the Minutemen since 2000 in first half. Well, it looked like an upset was in the making. Back-to-back -back threes by Evan Himes put Sienna up five, and their hot shooting streak continued with Evan Himes again. He had 15. Sienna with their largest lead of the day. They're up 16. Second half, Saints still firing on all cylinders with Rob Poole. Sienna was eight for their first 12 from deep. But then the tide seemed to turn. Chaz Williams sinks to three to cut the Siena lead to just two. One minute later, Samson Carter gives UMass the advantage. At that time, it was a 15 of four run for the Minutemen. But despite trailing by as many as six, Siena hung around. Freshman Ryan Oliver nails the three to tie the game at 58. Saints would have a four point lead, two and a half minutes remaining, when look at this, Odie Anasicki's shot circles around the rim and drops out. You're not gonna see that very often. Tough break and UMass took full advantage. Jesse Morgan's layup cuts the lead to one. Coming down to the final play, once again, Chaz Williams over Rob Poole to put UMass up with three seconds to go. Williams had 23 points. Williams with 23 and UMass has taken the lead, 64 to 63. Last play, Trinity Bredin throws it long, but it's tipped around, and the Saints could not recover. And they fall after a hard-fought effort to UMass, 64 to 63. It's a great basketball game. I mean, I could not have asked more for my kids. Uh, tremendous uh, um, intensity. It really, like a it reminded me of a tournament game. I mean, early in, in, no, in uh, November, I didn't think either team um, took a playoff. I thought there was tremendous intensity on the defensive end. I thought our guys battled. I think uh, we put together a game plan in one day. They executed it tremendously and, you know, it came down to one play and they, they have a great point guard, Williams. It's very frustrating. I think we really wanted this game. We really wanted to win this game. And we knew we could win this game. And to lose like that, it is very frustrating for us. But now we just got to bounce back. We got a big game Saturday.